Good morning, everybody, and welcome to High Q. But this is not just any round of High Q. We are down to our final four teams now. Two of them here today: the Carroll Patriots and the Miami Valley School Rams, going head to head to see who goes on to the championship game. Before we start asking questions, let's take a minute to meet both sides. Hi, my name is Tyler Benedict, and I'm a junior at the Miami Valley School. Hi, I'm Nate Rowland, and I'm a senior at the Miami Valley High School. Hi, I'm Alex Keene, and I'm a senior at the Miami Valley School. Hi, I'm David Calero, and I'm a senior at the Miami Valley School. Hello, I'm Howard Poston, and I'm a junior at Carroll High School. Good morning, I'm John McCardle, senior at Bishop John Carroll High School. Hi, I'm Joe Cerise, a senior at Dayton Carroll High School. Hi, I'm Carrie O'Connell, a junior at Carroll High School. Let's play Hike You! All right, here we go. A couple of schools who know what it's like to go this far. If Carroll wins today, they will get to our championship game for the first time since 2004. The Miami Valley School Rams have been there the last three years. This would be four in a row if they could pull one out today. Our game is four rounds of competition. In the opening round, we ask 10-point questions. Buzz in, give the correct answer, get the points incorrectly, answer the question, though. The other team can give the correct answer and steal those points away. Teams, if you're ready, here we go. Here's your first question in the opening round. In 1841, who became the first vice president to step into the presidency? David from Miami Valley. John Tyler. John Tyler is correct for 10 points. What English industrial port on the Irish Sea is famed as the birthplace of the Beatles? Uh, Tyler from Miami Valley. Liverpool. Liverpool, England. That is correct. What country is the size of Idaho and is on the northern coast of South America, east of Venezuela, west of uh, David from Miami Valley School? Colombia. No, that's incorrect. Let me finish the question for Carol. West of Suriname and north of Brazil. John. Ecuador. No, it's Guyana. Classify this sentence by its structure. I started a fire as soon as we set up camp, and now we're roasting marshmallows. John from Carroll. Compound. No, that's incorrect. Miami Valley School. Tyler. Conditional. Compound complex. Compound complex. Marty believes he is the synthesized reincarnation of Einstein, Mohammed, Attila the Hun, and Andy Warhol. Such false beliefs are delusions of what? Tyler from Miami Valley. Grandeur. Delu delusions of grandeur, that's correct. What verb means to rescind an attorney's license to practice law? David from Miami Valley. Disbar. That's disbar, that is correct. What invention patented in 1874 ended the era of the open range in the West? Tyler from Miami Valley. The telegraph. No, that's incorrect. Carol Chance to Steal Joe. Barbed wire. Barbed wire is correct. What state is bounded on the east by Nebraska and Kansas? David from Miami Valley. Colorado. Colorado is correct. It is not the shoreline, but the outer edge of what part of the ocean floor that forms the boundary of a continent? Uh, Joe from Carroll. Continental Shelf. Continental Shelf, Continental Slope, that's correct for 10 points. It is a literary quote referring to unity of purpose. Recite this most popular seven-word quote, which originally appeared in The Three Musketeers. Tyler from Miami Valley. All for one and one for all. That is correct for 10 points. Whenever the speed of an object doubles, its kinetic energy is multiplied by Howard from Carroll. Four. Four is correct. Almost all minerals come from a hot liquid material deep in the earth. Name this molten material. David from Miami Valley. Magma. Magma is correct. The Sikh wars of the 19th century occurred in what country? Tyler from Miami Valley. India. India is correct. What word ends this quote by New York Senator William Marcy in 1832? To the victor belong the Tyler from Miami Valley. Spoils. Spoils. Name the author of these tales, The Fox and the Crow, The Lion and the Mouse, The Milkmaid and Her Pupil, Tyler from Miami Valley. Asa? 
That was part of Aesop's fables. That's correct. A structure of Congress is defined in which article of the Constitution? Tyler from Miami Valley. Article 1. Article 1 is correct. The number of times a specified phenomenon occurs within a specified interval is called its what? John from Carroll. Right. No, that's not the word we're looking for. Miami Valley, Tyler. Frequency? Frequency is what we are looking for. Name the state of matter within the sun. Joe from Carroll. Plasma. Plasma is correct. Residents of what Asian city were surprised by a military operation led by General James Doolittle in 1942? David from Miami Valley. Tokyo, Japan. Tokyo is correct. A mixture of fats and oils. I'm sorry, we are out of time in our opening round and checking out the scoreboard after one round in this semifinal. Miami Valley 130, Carroll has some catching up to do, but plenty of time to do that. We're back with our bonus round in just a couple of minutes.